Hey y'all, Irix Guy here. Welcome back to another Irix Guy Supports Entrepreneurs video. And you can check the link within this video's description to find the playlist full of videos. But obviously this is catering to people that are entrepreneurs or people that are pondering whether or not they should become an entrepreneur. And something I'm going to address within this video is the problem that plagues many entrepreneurs. I think that that there may be a seemingly step-by-step -step process for success. So in other words, there's got to be there's got to be a path to follow. Maybe someone created a similar idea. Uh, maybe uh, they they've got to have something, some some sort of uh, some sort of path to follow. And that's that's a point of failure for a lot of people because the most successful, most of the most successful entrepreneurs, are people that dreamed up a product and/or service on their own. So they weren't they weren't looking to others to find the solution for their own success. Now it is important if you look at others from from a uh, from a brainstorming perspective because you can look at a variety of people that have that have been successful as entrepreneurs, you can look at a lot of people that have failed as entrepreneurs and you can learn both from those failures and those successes. So that's a way to better boost your own level of confidence in regards to whatever idea uh, whether it's a service or a product that you're trying to bring to market as an entrepreneur. So don't uh, don't expect to follow in anyone else's footsteps. Again, look at what's worked and what does not work for others. Look at it from that perspective to build your own level of inner confidence. But ultimately the ideas that are going to work are the ones that that one dreams up on their own. Because if it's just a piggyback off something else, yeah, sure, it may make some money, but it's not gonna make it's not gonna create a life changing event. Those life changing events are the events that are triggered out of one's own due diligence. You know, going out and really digging through the uh, and when I'm saying digging, I'm saying brainstorming. So whatever you're doing, you know, maybe you're riding your bike, maybe you're going for a jog, maybe you're just driving. Or maybe you're doing nothing at all, but I would recommend not thinking about it when you're trying to go to sleep because if you think about stuff, when you're thinking about business ideas when you're trying to go to sleep, then you're going to stay up longer, you're not going to be as well rested, and as a result of not being as well rested, then your productivity over time will start to decline because you won't have, you won't have the sense of alertness that's required to become an optimal entrepreneur. So if, if you take anything away from this particular video, you know, just remember, it's okay. It's okay to see what, ev what others have done to succeed and what others have done to fail. But it's not okay to mimic them because that's where your success will be greatly hampered, if, even if you're successful at all. Create your own ideas. Create something that others will want to try to follow. They want to, they'll want to follow in your footsteps based upon your own personal successes. So that's my advice for the day. Uh, stay tuned for more iRick Sky Supports Entrepreneurs videos soon. And is there a topic you would like to see me address within an upcoming video? Let me know. And then also I'm going to, um, at the time of posting this, I'm going to make the entrepreneurial type mentality a component of my live show. I have my live show every Thursday at noon New York City time. So be sure to uh, be sure to tune into that. And thanks for watching and be sure to subscribe. YouTube.com forward slash Irix guy. Y'all have a good day.